<laughs> Beyonce crossing over into country in a big way, becoming the first black female artist to score a number one spot on the song chart. ABC's Rena Roy says the achievement is also bringing bigger visibility to others in the country music world because the song is everywhere, Rena. Good morning again. It truly is everywhere, Janae. I gotta say, I've loved your dance moves this morning. <laughs> and I think it goes without saying, Beyonce can really do it all, right? Her latest country songs are not only breaking records, but breaking down doors for other black country artists striving for mainstream recognition. This morning, Queen Bee adding another jewel to her crown, making history yet again with her new country hit. Becoming the first black woman ever to top Billboard's hot country music chart. Texas Hold'em holding that number one spot ahead of her highly anticipated new album, Act Two. It'd be the first black woman to debut at number one for Texas Hold'em. That's history in itself. The Beehive buzzing along with the country music world, also putting the spotlight on other black female artists who are making their own way in the genre, like Tanner Adele. And Mickey Guyton. Country music also looks like this. Writing, I'm grateful that Beyonce has expanded this conversation, and now so many amazing artists are getting the shine they deserve. Beyonce isn't the only Black artist tapping into that country genre, and it's good that this is a conversation. This is something that's really going to open the doors for like new country artists that might be watching this. And it comes after this surprise Grammys performance with Luke Combs and Tracy Chapman. I'd always hope for better. Her classic hit, Fast Car, immediately skyrocketing in sales and streams more than three decades after its debut. Chapman also becoming the first black person to ever win Song of the Year at the Country Music Awards. And guys, none other than Dolly Parton herself gave Beyonce her stamp of approval, saying she's a big fan and cannot wait to hear the album. And look, clearly we can't wait either. Wit's been knee slapping, Janae's been horse riding. I've had this song on repeat. It's a good song. Can't you can't blame us, right? Yes. And, and the awesome thing about Dolly Parton, she was interviewed once about, I think it was Jolene, and said that she would love to hear Beyonce sing it. Uh, can you imagine that? Finger exactly. Exactly. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.